The Skateboard Watchtower Movie Review is brought to you by... Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, welcome to Skateboard Watch Terror Movie Review. Movie Review. You know, just when I get tasted something, you, you, you ain't got nothing in there, man. I just want to think. Why you want to, you know, you, you leave just a swallow of orange juice and you stick it back in there. Well, why you do that, man? Yeah, I'm not all water orange juice, but I get the stick. Well, then why don't you just swallow it and go off? <laughs> quick! Quick! I don't get you, quick! Go get my brother, quick! What are we talking about, man? Harlem Nights! Harlem Nights! Eddie Murphy, written and produced, and yeah, all that good stuff, man. Harlem Nights with Richard Pryor. Pryor. Richard Pryor. Red Fox. Red Fox. Uh, Della Reese. Della Reese. Arsenio, Arsenio Hall. Hall. I mean, oh my gosh, man. I, I mean, mean, it's like who's who. I mean, Danny Ayo. Yeah. Ayo. Ayala. Danny Ayo. I mean, it is. <laughs> small breaths. Small breaths. You just got to take small uh, breaths. Yeah, Harlem Nights, man. I mean, actually, I guess I got to love this because it's based on a little kid coming in, saving, saving uh, Richard, uh, Pryor. Richard Pryor, who was, like, had this small gang house at the time, and they, and then a uh, little kid, which goes up, which is Richard Pryor's part, name's Quick, uh, and they're in the business together, and they got this big booty uh, nightclub, and uh, of course the. Mafia wants to move in and, and, and take it out and take it over. Um, and the, it's just, I gotta say, man, this is one of those movies that's got you laughing. And, oh, yeah. And, and you just can't quit laughing at it. And the I fight mean, scene between between Quick and then Arsenio's character with two <laughs> buddies. Like, bah, bah, man, I don't know bah, what you're bah, talking bah, about. Uh, what you talking about, man? You killed my brother, Quick. I'm going to tell you again, I don't know what you're there, talking about. They're sitting there shooting two Tommy guns. Ba -da -da -da. And the other guy, the driver, pop, got that little piece of pop, 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 pop. What are you talking about? Quit! Stop it! I mean, I mean and and also, got I can tell uh, Eddie Murphy going into the, and writing this, he was a fan of those Bogart movies. He was a fan of those gangster films from uh, the, the 30s and 40s. I mean, you can tell, and... and, and and I think it was kind of cool how he adapted that very well. And I well, love, you know, he got about on, on, on the scenes from Harlem with with the it, at yeah. the time what they was called, uh, you know, the Great uh, Depression. Knock out, you know, you had to knock on the door. Speakies, you know, speakies, yeah, and guy opens up. Prohibition, the, thing, the prohibition area, uh, all that stuff. And also, and he you just know, took this movie too, just to that one extra part. I mean, and. It is so real. I love it's the so fight real. between him and Della Reese. <laughs> oh my god. You better knock it I'll off from the pinky off. I'm gonna shoot your little pinky off. <laughs> shoot that little shoot my little pinky toe. <laughs> <laughs> just a look Pow! on his face when he does it. And I mean and, and, and it's I like he looks looks over at the guy, she's like 
<laughs> it's just it's so funny how, how I mean, and he's one of those people. I know mean, with a lot of they do use a lot of uh, language, so yeah, you yeah. Got kids around you may want to do it, but yeah. you as an adult is going to get you will you will you will appreciate it because I mean it, and it, it's so it's period. Yes, uh, it's, it's period. Time period. It's period. It's, it's period. perfect. And I mean how they set the thing up and. You know, with the the world boxing champion. Yeah, he's, oh gosh, he's like, like he's I mean, you don't take don't, don't take his this, this athlete with breath, man. I'm gonna make 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 then yeah, he's, he's more of the businessman. Yeah, yeah, and, 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 and he and looks he, at things from that business point of view, and he try, you know, and that's he why he's trying pulls to teach it off really, really because well. He actually, you know, brought. He, I don't know if he actually adopted quick. I he, would say he adopted. He's he all father and son. And he I mean, his son and everything. So yeah. when he's sitting there, you know, so he's trying to he's trying to get his he's son trying to teach understand him. these things. Don't don't don't. This girl, this girl is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been woman. around this. Yeah. Sh- <laughs> voodoo woman. Red put Fox. the voodoo on you. <laughs> she put the voodoo on you. Put the voodoo on you. <laughs> Red Fox. And of course, Red Fox. I love the glasses. Red I love to put the glasses on you. No, that's not good. I mean, he's just close. I mean, I grew up watching these guys, man, stand and up. And I mean, I grew up watching TV Red Fox on Sanford and Son. I grew up seeing Richard Pryor stand up. You know, I mean, I'm sitting here and I'm watching this movie. I mean, and, I, and it, was, it takes you back to the moments when you're growing up and you actually get to see all this. So and all these people coming together and making. Oh make yeah, a great and movie. I mean, that's uh, the thing. I mean, it's a great film as far as if you want to see this film, go to the Game Store and More, Marion, North Carolina. Why you sent a copy of it? Trust me, you'll want to watch this again. And like I said, I mean it's it's one of those films you could tell they had fun making the film. I don't see how they didn't. Have, I mean, I how heard, they even, how they even I, got I did kind of look up on some time. of this on on the film, just kind of my personal, just looking it up. And I heard there was some problems with Richard Pryor's personal problems, but other than that, everybody got along great and everything went great. But you know, it happens. But. That's the thing. I mean, because all of them get all these comedians together. Yeah, yeah. And, and you're laughing. They and had to be the laughing. They that, had to be laughing. That's the thing that I was saying, because they were cracking up and laughing at the action done. If they would have shot the majority of that stuff, they had more of that than they would have what they would have had with the film. Yeah. So, yeah, yeah, so, yeah, so I mean, that's and, like and, one and, of the things that they And also, the I want so. to speak out on this from the cars, the car chases, the building scenes. The big wide screen. It looks like 1930s I it's Harlem. I mean, it's period, man. You, I mean, it looks like 1930s Harlem. Yeah, you I can't. Mean, that's what I love about From it. other films that I have seen, where they tried to set it in the period, and you could tell it was either a matte drop. Uh, this right here looked well, like it was shot copy, pretty, it, they, pretty they on. Had, I mean, down to the guns, to the... Oh, oh yeah. Man, and I mean, man, I, like, I like how most of the time when you saw the... Uh, 1911 Colts that they had throughout the movie, you, and of course, that's generally what they had. They all had ivory grips. Oh uh, yeah, well, I mean, most of them the all had. Things, so they went and paid that extra money for it. So they had the, the ivory uh, grips, and all. you know, I mean, and they even had you know the, the Tommy guns. Of course, had the. And that, uh, and, 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 and I want to say this: a Thompson good movie. looks vicious, looks like it, hurt, and it does hurt, but it's more bark than bite. Uh, I disagree with you on that. I've shot one. And I mean, oh, they can tear you to pieces. Why, there's a reason why that was used by the gangsters. And oh, yeah. I mean, I'm not saying that they're, that they're not lethal they would, or nothing They would like that. tear you out apart because, I mean, it was... As least far as distance is what I'm saying. Well, like, distance, yeah, yeah. But, I mean, but yeah, I back mean, then, this is one of the things because... It, 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 you were shooting for me to you. 20 feet, man, dude. You're, you're dead. I mean... And, and, and that's, that's the thing, I mean... But that's one thing I got to say about, about this I, movie, dude. I had a freaking ball just sitting there. And when, I mean, the first time I saw it when it first came out, into now, you still put that and, smile on my face, that laughter. And, like, and you think, you know, as funny as this film is, as hilarious as this film, it bombed at the box office. It was an, and, and, and that's the thing, why? 
Like, it did great at the box office, but I think there was, you know, it was just overshadowed by, I think, some other films. Yeah, there's some more film stuff to come out. But also, I don't think it was actually marketed in the correct way. No. And, uh, no. but I mean, it, it actually, the, the DVD stuff started start picking up afterwards, man. So And VHS, too. Yeah, I mean, and so VHS, yeah, it became a cult so. film. It's become kind of a um, cult film. But yeah, I mean, great actors, great storyline. And it was, it was fun. <laughs> Uh, and like I said, it was period, so I mean, it, it was, I actually enjoyed it. So, all one to five stars for entertainment. Five. 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 Give me five. Five. Five myself. <laughs> How about authenticity? One to five. Authenticity. Five. I'm giving it a five. Because it was pretty it accurate. Was not pretty much, I mean, I mean, it was... Some things that you kind you of can't like, be absolutely you can't perfect. be absolutely perfect on because it was I mean it and, was and, and times it's an it's it an was, interpretation it's of inter what it yeah, was. And I love it, so I'm giving it a five. Yeah, I mean yeah, yeah. Give it a five. Now, popcorn value one to ten. Ten. Give it a ten. So this score is the movie scored pretty high on both of us. Yeah. And uh I know when uh uh like I said, when I watched it, it just put a small thing, made me laugh again. I mean, that was one thing I want. If you're feeling bad, you want to laugh. Watch this movie; it will, it will, put, it'll make you laugh. Oh yeah, and, so, and, and and that's the thing. Like, you have to love this movie. Yeah, just, yeah, I mean, it's. Yeah, just, it's just, <laughs> I mean, well, I mean, I'm uh, seeing so many stuff in my head already going back, and I'm about ready to bust out laughing you soon. Well, but, it, yeah. So, Harlem Knots. Eddie Murphy, Richard Pryor, Della Reese, Red, Red Fox. Fox, Arsenio Hall, uh -huh. and so many others. Yeah. Go watch it. Go it watch it. You'll, 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 you'll love it. You'll love it. So, for myself, Del McCoyle, and Nick Revis. Nick the Revelator. Love piece of chicken grease. We're out of here. Heh, <laughs> heh,